Ming Lawashi. May I introduce myself? I am Titi Su, representative from Myanmar. I work for Renewable Energy Research Department under the Department of Research and Innovation as Deputy Director. It's fortunate being a woman in Myanmar is that there is no gender discrimination and Myanmar has the culture of favorable opportunity to those who are more capable and the state has also been constantly encouraging the development of the role of women entrepreneurs. In such situation, the ASEAN US Science Space for Women providing support and recognized for more development and strengthening of human scientists is much more meaningful to me as well as to women community in my country. I would like to verify to Myanmar women that the prize as a benchmark which acknowledge high capability of the Myanmar female scientists who is from average family works hard and struggles is the reason that I apply for the prize. Although wind energy is promising and still let's afford it use in Myanmar recently. I have focused and performed the wind energy research work since 2009. In the meanwhile, I had attended the international training programs of Life Academy CWET and also been selected for Talent Young Scientist program. I could contribute my research finding not only via international journals but also the book. Then I shared an exchange about wind energy of Myanmar, a speaker in Symbolsian and workshop on sustainable energy. Moreover, I currently mentor a wind energy training course offered by our department. Especially for regional collaboration, I am Myanmar government representative in ASEAN Renewable Energy Outlook program as well as steering committee member of EV Mekong for Renewable Energy Project Development. My energy concerns for Myanmar are design and construction of small-scale wind turbine for short term, research and development on wind farm design and hybrid system for mid term, and formulation of Myanmar Renewable Energy policy, strategy, and roadmap to fulfill Myanmar energy needs. For sustainable future of ASEAN, we should implement not only resource management, but also soft-scale human resource management by awarding not only science prizes, but also policy prizes. Well, effectually, a sixth, the continual brilliant future of ASEAN. In conclusion, I would carry out more and more for sustainable energy development by contributing, mentoring, and cooperating in various sectors on behalf of Myanmar women. If I became the winner of ASEAN US Science Prize for Women, kindly accept my sincere thanks.